All right, hey, I'm here in Overland Park, Kansas. It's my nephew's birthday party tomorrow, or party today, birthday tomorrow. I just got challenged by an agency to make some calls from some leads and give you some real life results. These are older leads, these aren't even new, but I want you to be able to see me actually call these and live dials right in front of you. So I got about uh, 47 minutes left, and I got about 36. I got about 36. Um, great time to call. I got about 36. I got about 36 leads that are generated over the last looks like about mm, 60 days, maybe. And so I'm gonna call those on camera because you guys love when I do that. So I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna even put them on speaker. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice. I'm not even gonna leave a voicemail. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice. Mary. Yeah, Mary. Hey, this is hey, this is Cody. Hey, I'm getting back to you about your request for the new final expense information. Now, she hung up on me. I'm gonna see if I can get her back on. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice. All right, move on to the next one. Mr. Dwayne. Yes. Hey, Dwayne. Hey, this is Cody. Hey, I'm getting back to you, buddy, about the uh, your request for the new final expense information. Now, I'm the local field underwriter, Dwayne. I'll be out in Norwood on Monday. Should I drop this information off? What do you think, in the morning or in the afternoon? What are you talking about? Yeah, it was, it was on, uh, you had responded on Facebook about the new final expense information and it's my job to make sure that I, I'm the local guy, so it's my job to make sure I get that to you. Um, are mornings or afternoons typically better for you? Uh, probably mornings. Mornings? Uh, what? Yeah. Normally like, normally like early mornings or late mornings? Uh, early morning, I'll tell you what, you get dropped out of my workplace. Okay, all right, perfect. What, what time? Uh, Okay. Why don't I do uh, Why don't I do nine a.m. Is that cool? Okay, that's fine. And, and you just have to drop it off. You can't talk to me just that. Be busy. Okay. Well, and unfortunately, there's something that we have to um, obviously show you. We've got to drop it off with you. Um, what, what's your what, What's your work schedule typically like? Are you like a eight thirty to five thirty Monday through Friday or what? Yeah, this was something that you had requested information on. Um, it had to do with the new final expense information, and it's my job just to make sure that I get it in your hands because I'm the local guy that services that area. Um, yeah. So, so what? Um, it, it'd probably be easier for me if I'm able to just drop it off when you're home. Um, would that be? Would Monday or Tuesday be better for that? Thursday, let me look, buddy. Um, Thursday, yeah, they've, they've got me back in the area, but they do have me a little busier that day. Um, what time were you thinking? Um, I got 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock, Thursday, 9 a.m., and, and you said you'd be home? Yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll be scared at the truck stop. You know well, um, are, are you at... Is that still you? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it'll probably be easier on me if, if, if that's okay, buddy, if I just drop it off there. Okay. Um, so it's... Okay. And then uh, I'm actually putting you in my calendar now. Um, 
And can you grab a pen and paper for me real quick or, or, or type this in your phone? I want to give you my name and then also the day and time again real, real quick. Okay. You just tell me when you're ready. Okay, so my name's my name is um, Cody, and we're looking at Thursday at nine a.m. Okay. Okay, and would there be any reason you can think of that would keep you from being there Thursday at nine? No, Okay. Perfect. Well, Mr. Dwayne, I appreciate your time, buddy. I hope you have a great rest of your weekend, and I've got you down for next Thursday at nine. Okay. All righty. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. Bye-bye. One hangs up on you, you call the next one set an appointment. That dude, that dude, that was not an easy call. He didn't want me to come to his, he wanted me to go to his work. Then he wanted to meet me somewhere in town. Ultimately, I ended up meeting him where I want to meet him, which is at his house. I mean, anybody can do that. Donald. Yeah. Hey, Donald. Hey, this is Cody, buddy. Hey, I'm getting back to you. Uh, the reason I'm calling you this morning is I'm getting back to you about your request for the new final expense information. And I'm the local field underwriter for the Ava area. Uh, and I've got to, I'll be out there on um, Monday or this next Thursday. Which is better to drop off some information to you? Uh, I, know I got, got the mic to shut down, but I don't need it now. Sure, absolutely, yeah. No, it, it's not my job to, you know what I mean, change anything. Yeah, I know. I just got to make sure that I at least get it in your hands, and, and kudos to you for doing that. Um, are mornings or afternoons typically better to, to drop this off to you? Well, I don't need it. Um, this, if this drop comes off, yeah, I don't mind, but sure. I'm going to be busy at around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Okay. Um... What about this next Thursday? I've actually got to be out in that area in the morning. Um, what about like 10.30 next Thursday? I guess that'd be fine. That would be. Okay. Can, can, can you grab a pen and paper for me real quick? Because I'm going to go ahead and add you to my calendar. I just don't want you to either one of us forget about it, okay? Yes, 10.30 on next Thursday, on uh, the 31st, or 30th, yeah. Um, I have to get the calendar and see what day that's. Oh, 28th. 28th. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, and, and you can go ahead and add my name, too. My name's Cody, okay? Cody, okay. Hey, and, and you're still... Yep. Is that... Is that... Right. And hey, do you know where I got the 400 from, or did I just have that wrong? Okay, well, I've been known to do that too, so no worries. Okay, well, we will see you this next uh, Thursday at, uh, what time did we say again? 10. 10.30? Yeah, you think you'd be around out in the around 10, 10.30. Yep, yep, that'll be that, that'll still be perfect. All righty, well, hey, thank you, thank you, sir. Have a great weekend. Yeah, you too. Bye-bye. There's an inbound call for you. And he already had life insurance. He didn't want to meet. He didn't need to meet. But it isn't up to him if he meets with me. Hello, Renee. Yes. Hey, this is Cody. Hey, I'm getting back to you about your request for the new final expense information, and I'm the local field underwriter for the Branson area, and I'll be out that way on Monday. Are mornings or afternoons better for you? You know what? I have a I have an appointment uh, Monday at in the afternoon, and I've got to be down at the employment center in the morning. I can't do it Monday. Finally, expense, um, I have a life insurance plan. Uh, 
Okay, great. Yeah, and this it's not my job to, you know what I mean, like change anything. I'm just there to make sure that you have the new updated information that they want us to at least make sure that you have in your hands. Um, what time are you, because they do have me really busy, but I think I could squeeze you in for a couple minutes. What time are you at the uh, employment office? Um, I'm usually down there uh, on Mondays uh, around 9 or so. Okay, okay. Um, and then how long are you normally there? Uh, you know what? I don't know if you're doing a resume for me. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. That's exciting. So I'll, and, get, I'll, get that. I'll get that. And then, and then what's your, uh, what, what time's your appointment Monday afternoon? I'm looking at my calendar is the reason I'm asking. Okay, okay. Um, so, the, the, can you tell me about this over the phone? Unfortunately, we're supposed to make sure that we at least get it in your hands. Um, that way we can answer any questions you have. I don't have much time on Monday, but I could probably squeeze you in about 1 o'clock if that's okay. Are, are you still at... Oh, I love that area. I uh, I was I was just in a charity golf tournament that because I'm 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 real active in the community and the area. Uh, I was in a charity golf tournament there uh, this past summer, so that's a beautiful area. Yeah. Well, let's do this. Um, let's let's do this, Renee. Um, again, my name is Cody. Can you go ahead and can you grab a pen and paper for me real quick? No, no, I understand, and, that, and that's it's just my job to make sure that you have the information. Yep, and, and, and it's up to you with what you do with it, whenever you do it, if you ever do it, you know what I mean? So, um, I have a, I have a 1.30 and a 2, so I'll have to be really quick if that's okay. Uh, so, and my name is, in, in, are, are you in a place to write this down? Yeah. Okay, my name's Cody, and... I'll swing by and drop that off really quick Monday at 1, okay? I got to I got to head out of the office here in a couple minutes and head to a birthday party for my nephew. So, I hope I hope you have a wonderful weekend, all right? Okay. All right. Hey, thank you so much. You've been really sweet and I hope you have a great weekend. Okay, thank Thanks, you. Ma'am. Bye. -bye. All right, three appointments, about 35 dials, and about 40 minutes from leads that are over 30, over 60, some older than 90 days old. It's all about putting forth the activity, the action, and going for it. I'm telling you what, if I can do it in about 35, 40 minutes, so can you.